the Riverdale Carnival presents the Archies. Take care of the kissing booth while we're singing, Sabrina. Okay, everybody. Here we go with our new hit record. Sugar, sugar. Sugar. of loving you I just can't believe it's true I just can't believe the wonder of this feeling too I just can't believe it's true Ah, sugar Kiss could be. I know how sweet a kiss can be. Like the summer sunshine, pour your sweetness over me. Pour your sweetness over me. Okay, sugar, sugar. All right, kids, you've just seen the Archies on film. We thought it'd be really great for our special segment today to bring in our special guest and, and get in all of the five voices of the Archies. Are you ready? Introducing our guest, Mr. Ron Dante. Hi. How are you doing, Ron? Let me see. Look him. Thank you. Uh, only Hello, one group. of them, huh? Well, where's the rest of them? Uh, oh. Ron, that, that needs an explanation. Go well, ahead. The thing is, this... Uh... Those five voices you heard on the record are all mine. I, uh, I do what they call multi-tracking, meaning I sing once, I sing again, I sing again, and uh, finally, by the end of the uh, session, you have five, six voices, just like as if you five sang. Well, I just put all my voices on, high and low. I sing very high, very low, and that's the way I get it. That's the way I become the Archies. Hey, by the way, Ron, this is a... Uh... These guys here are the Silver Moon. All right, Silver Fantastic Moon. Fantastic group. You're going to see them in a little while. We're going to play you some oh, film on them we did about a week ago. Great. Anything you want to ask me? Well, all right. I wonder what's open to young groups? In, in what, which way? Which way? Um, professional field. I mean, getting ahead. Oh, you mean open and uh, getting, starting? Yeah. Well, you can, uh, it's, it's a little tough, but you can uh, start by uh, putting together some tapes. Fine, get yourself a little studio, go to a studio, right? put some money together, save some money from your allowance or whatever, and uh, go in the studio and put some, down some songs, either somebody else's, or if you write, which is really good, put down the songs that you write in the studio and uh, you know, get some records out of it. Then, then you have to take your tapes around or have someone send them around. At each company, each record company, there's an A&R man. Man just listens to tapes all day, and he'll listen to your tape. He'll take the time out, he'll listen to your tape, and he'll, uh, he'll call you back and say, I like it or I hate it, but at least you'll get a chance. And that's, what you, that's where you should start. Also, you should try to get yourself a manager. That's very important. What makes a, a group like Silver Moon really special? How do they know if they've really got something that the whole country would be interested in? I, I really don't know. Uh, at the beginning, you really don't know. 
have to try uh, different uh, experiments with your voices, see which voices sound the best, seeing lead or background. Uh, to be unique and special, you must start with uh, good songs. If you have some good songs, if you have what, uh, if you have what uh, I call uh, that special magic in the song, it'll come through. But you must start, start with really good songs. You should write. I mean, if, uh, any young group, I would say, write. Well, somebody who's trying to be, who wants to be a professional musician, and should he study something to fall back on? Yes, study is very important. I mean, you can't just go pick up a guitar. You can't pick up your guitar and play something. You must study, at least in the beginning, in the early years. Right now is about the best time for you to study. Get the basic foundation of a good background behind you, and then go ahead and make up your own things. Then create. But at least know what you start with. You must study. You must take some time out. I know that's difficult, you know, you'd rather go out and play ball, you'd rather go out with your girlfriend, you'd rather go watch a movie. But if you really love your music, if you really want to be a star, you have to get out there and study. You have to, you have to, you have to take the time out after school and go, uh, go to your teacher and let them bang some good things in your heads. Hey, listen, you, you just heard Sugar Sugar, right? Mm -hmm. Now, that was like five years ago. Now, we're into disco music. So what I thought would be nice is to do a disco version of Sugar Sugar. Would you like to hear it? Okay. Fantastic. Yeah. Listen. See, now that's, that's new. See, we, what we've taken is some of the new elements of the music today from a, and use an old song. That's why I say listen to the radio. Make sure that you know what's going on. Well, know what your competition is. Then go out and create your own, but at least know what's happening in the music world. I'd like to know who does what in the group. Craig, what do you do? I play bass. Bass, you're the bass. I play keyboards. Oh, Dennis? Drums. I knew he was the drum. He looks like a drum. Percussion. Ronnie? Percussion. Eric? Guitar. And, and you're the lead singer. Yeah. I'd re I really would like to, you know, see what you guys do. Okay, did. well, then we're, we're going to let you see what these guys really? do. I think you're really going to be impressed. Oh, great. Shot with lead. I'll get back to that later. Ooh, baby, you 
great. Okay, guys. I that love that. Really fantastic. Was, was that the first time you were in the studio? Yeah. yeah. The first time? Recording. First time you ever put headphones on? Yep. 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 <laughs> How did it feel? It was great. Great. Yeah. It was really good. That was exciting. very good. That was very good. It was the first time. I think that's wonderful. The so bass and drums. You two guys are cooking like crazy. That's really, I'm telling you, that's very important in young groups. They often have a good lead singer, you're very good. And songs are okay, but the bass and drums usually fall apart. And you guys are tight. You sound like you've been playing together like two, three years. How long have you been playing together? Nine. Yeah. Nine months. Yeah. Nine, nine, nine. I'd love to hear another number. Do you have any other stuff? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You know you should be alive. You 